Hello, everybody. Swift here again with another Magic Craft run. The action combat roguelike that allows you to break the game by creating your own spells. And today I'm gonna play on normal mode, I would say, just to try some new stuff out and also get a bit more meta progression. I wanna do like more of a Mimi build, maybe boomerangs, maybe swords, maybe something, something, something. We're gonna see. Difficulty isn't really that important in my opinion anyway. So let's do the run. Let's see how it's gonna go. And I found an arcane explosion right away, which in general is pretty powerful, so might as well use that. Uh, so we're gonna go close to explode them. Actually, early game, I'm not really sure if it is worth it. Uh, because it's gonna be spending a bit more mana than what it needs to. Although, on, on that side, uh, we do have more mana regen anyway. Specifically because of the fact that... Wait a minute. What happens if I go into settings and go with uh, Arachnophobia safe mode? What happens here? This is more monstrous than I thought it would be. Yeah, we're gonna go back to actual Arachnophobia. But I have to say that it's nice that they added that as a choice. Should also have colorblind mode, just saying. Reduce damage taken by 25%. That's nice. Let's take that. We got a nice little early game uh, safety thing. I would like to either go boomerangs or swords, as I already mentioned. Uh, let's go with money. I didn't do a sword build yesterday, but it wasn't actually a sword build. It was more of a Harry Potter build. Um, I guess a Voldemort build, to be honest. Uh, so let's see if I can today get the sword build I would like to create. Which uh, would need some very specific things, but I think we can do that. I think we got this. Oh, I'll avoid. I got slowed a bit, but it's okay. These guys leave the slow trail on the ground forever. Let's see what we can get here. A bunch of money, but fright. I mean, I already picked it up. Teleport the random location and take damage. I don't think it's worth it. I don't think it's worth to get a curse for that. Let's get the money and let's go over to max health. Which isn't really that good either, they're borderline useless, but it's okay. Uh, these guys, I think the red ones are the safe ones and the purple ones are the ones that are uh, explode on death. Let's not be close to that if possible. Whoop, almost got hit. I think I just exploded there for a crit. Did that guy almost jump into the pit? Into the pit you shall go, man. Into the pit you shall go. These guys are just chilling, vibing. Nice. Tried to summon another one, but they didn't. Uh, I would say let's go relics as we most of the time do. Although maybe money for getting the spells I want is the actual play. I should try that at some point. Just straight up don't even go relics whatsoever. Only get a spell build going and the relics are relevant. Maybe. Who knows. Uh, no longer slow down while casting spells. One point of shield or chance to heal when you kill an enemy. Mm, these are all very whatever. This is proactive blocking. This is reactive healing. I guess let's go with reactive healing. These are very bad. Let's maybe not go relics again. Let's go only money and... Let's try that. Let's go only money and spells if we can do so today. Uh, just to see how it's gonna go. And I even have healing anyway, so I'm, I'm covered for relics. Now, there are a lot of good relics like crit chance and whatnot that help you with uh, getting a bust build going or mana regen. Can explosion and thunder core. I could try thunder core. I mean, it's it's a good item anyway. Let's go now. Can explosion. The right spell is released when the left spell ends. Actually, let's do this so I can do a duet. Uh, bullets that shoot or can explosions that are electric. Yeah, that's safer in my opinion and more powerful to be honest. Yeah, and now we also have. Yeah, this is a lot better. A lot better. Uh, let's go into this. There isn't really anything to be done here. I don't have a key. Yep, there isn't anything to be done. Let's go. Do the trees or the trunks drop anything? As far as I know, they don't. This is a good proof and clarity. Yeah. I broke so many trunks and nothing happened. I would assume that's not a thing. Ah, this is the easiest boss between all of the early game bosses. This just copies what I do. So as long as I'm just slowly trickling over to the right side while it's shooting, uh, it should never be able to hit us. Easy enough. I really enjoy this boss just because of the simplicity of it. And we got a good AP region. Let's scatter. This is a decent weapon. And then we also got this one, which is also a decent weapon. This is more mana region. It has less attack speed though and less cooldown. So it has bad stats in the attack speed department, but it has good stats in the mana region department. And this is the opposite. Uh, let's go with the old wand. I'm not really sure. I mean, I guess attack speed is what I care about, but I think my base wand has better attack speed even from this thing. Ah, let's go other hand. Uh, was I correct? I was correct. This was 15 and 15. So in mana region, 15 and 17 on this one. Well, we don't have mana region issues anyway, so there is no real reason. Ah, we do. I mean, with the damage we're doing, we shouldn't. Uh, let's go with combining and crafting spells. Maybe a bit too early here. I do have money, though, for it, so let's might as well do it. Let's combo my good old uh, classic shots, as we always do. So we have a pre-upgraded thing. 
what the build's gonna be. I said boomerangs or swords if possible, so I would like to do boomerangs or swords if possible. So let's re-roll the hover. For sure, let's see what we can find out of that. Poison, not really. Broad, no. Volley, not really. Arcane Explosion twice. It has been a long time since I did Arcane Explosion. And honestly, I would like to combine those and then maybe re-roll the leveled up thing. That's also a bit safer in my opinion. Going that route. Uh, red spider eggs. Yeah, completely relevant. Red spiders are ranged spiders, but not poison spiders. Uh, I think you only find red spiders in this difficulty. This is a single eye big red spider. Yeah, these are literally different opponents based on the fact that I'm playing on normal mode. This is n normally a double eyed spider. So uh, it's good to realize the differences. It's not just everything is easier. No, no, no. It's literally opponents are different, which I really, really much enjoy. And I agree with that take on this genre. That should be the way your difficulty should be in most of these games, right? The opponents just have less mechanics if you play on easy mode. Uh, expand slots, but you do less damage. Mm, I don't think I want to create like a mega super duper spell build. I could try something like that. Nah, I have specific things in mind. Let's get keys for sure. Pets is a thing I could have gone with. Fanatic. Insane attack speed. Charge four points every time a spell is cast with this wand. I don't think so. My bullet score, I want them to. This could work with boomerangs. Could this work with boomerangs? I'm thinking this could work with boomerangs. Or, or uh, I become electricity. That could also be a build. Let's go tracking. That can build some stuff. I don't want the pets. Not now. I decided to switch it up. Crits, not really. Let's roll these. I'm also looking down here. Mana region is also a yes. Almost, always a yes. All ones have mana region. That's the best one of the game. So we just got three mana region on everything. For the rest of the game. Double keys. Very nice. Uh, rotating shots. No. I might do a build the rotating shots at some point, but not today. Go to those. And I would say let's maybe get the eight coins. Uh, this for eight. Just so we have things to re-roll. I want to go... You know what? Now I have decided. We're going money all the time. Money, money, money. And forget even relics. So the most important thing is spells first. Money second. Relic third. And I want to try to create a build the way I wanted to. And to get the thing going. Which I would... I, actually, I want to do a big sword build. Lose 10% max MP. Definitely no. And uh, let's see what we get out of this. Relic options plus one. Or get mana when you kill stuff. Both of these are good. Let's go with Relic Options. And let's go into a for spell choice, which is exactly what I would have chosen regardless. And we found the potion. The blue potion, as far as I remember, is... Mm, no, I don't remember what that does. I straight up don't. Opponents get binned, and we won. And the potion is... Permanently increasing P region by one. Wow, one of the best potions in the game, I guess. Not gonna drink it yet, though. I'm gonna drink it when we get choices to do. Oh, we got a rare and another rare. We're gonna get both rares. I can reroll this, and this is definitely one of the better ones. The Mimic Cube, obviously, is one of the better ones. Uh, let's go on. I don't think there is any reason to combine things yet. I think we still are pretty nice here. I would say let's reroll spells. Let's start getting the spells we want. Uh, but, but when I said combined, I meant to build this up. Uh, we do have things that we want to throw out. And more specifically, we want to throw out this thing. Things that I want to keep should go in a different spot. This, These two need to go away, and these three. I'm gonna stay. So let's uh, roll, first of all, this into something that we care about. And this might be good. Let's roll this into sword attack. Oh, double shots. And I already got something decent here. So theoretically, I could go double shots that explode uh, with duet. And this can is not needed. Something like this. What would that look like? And I can control these. Yeah, it's explosion that shoot explosion that shoot explosions. Yep, this is a pretty powerful thing right now that I created. So, yeah, let's, let's actually stick to this for the time being. Uh, is that true, though? I said I want to go sword strikes and I'm already diverting from the build. Uh, yeah, let's, let's not divert from the build for once. Let's actually stick to what I said I want to do. So, let's, let's rotate back to the build. You're gonna reroll. The split's gonna reroll. This, this is gonna stay. Multi shock's gonna stay because this is gonna be part of the sword build anyway. Uh, or the boomerang for that matter. Release four times the spell on the right side when that ends. What would that look like? I just more explosions. No, I'm gonna keep to it so this continues working out. Nope. 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 I found boomerang. So now I can have my boomerang as my main weapon. Although this happens at the end. What would this look like? 
That's so weird. Yeah, I mean, we're not gonna do that. We're gonna do... What would this look like? Oh, that's actually cool. It's a bullet that becomes a boomerang at the end of it. And that's I, that, that thing I enjoy. Oh, the boomerang is borderline controllable. Borderline controllable. You know what? If I can get more of these tracking, it might make it actually better. I think it just stops get a tracking strength at some point. Yeah, right about here. Now I cannot do anything for it. So it, you can be controlled only while it's in flight, which is good to see. Uh, I definitely want to copy... Let's copy this. Right, so that means I have more control over this. But at the end, it still goes down. I do enjoy this. I do enjoy the boomerang armada. Uh, let's go spells, obviously. I should have rerolled, by the way. Maybe I was a bit too eager to go away from there. Go, my boomerangs. Go, my boomerangs. Let's look at this. I like this. I like this a lot. That's nice. And let's open up. Oh, no, I didn't want to click that. It's okay. I wouldn't take this anyway. Let's get an echo. Let's really release the right spell at 80% magic cost when they hit an enemy. Wait a minute. What's better? Echo. Left spell releases the right spell at 8% magic cost when they hit an enemy. Against the right spell release when the left spell ends, the spell inherits 10% of the damage of the left spell. Why would I ever take this? This is when it hits an enemy. Yeah, this is just straight up worse. I guess it, it's cheaper. Yeah, it's cheaper. That's the difference. I don't care about cheapness though. Let's go. We found uh, unable to read the labels, but you get money. Or... Um, enter stealth if you don't attack when entering the current magic value of all ones zero. No, both of these are mech. Chalice of Greed is really, really good in general as an item, but I don't want to be unable to read label doors until I have the ability to somehow get rid of the curse. So that's a very big gamble I'm not really willing to take. As it's gonna make us lose control over what I'm doing. Let's go. Let's go. Maybe a mistake on my end. Let's see how much damage we do with this. Chaotic Wreckage. This thing is dying most of the time pretty fast. Whoa! Okay, it seems like things do not despawn between rooms. And we destroy this guy in seconds. Off into the secret room we go. I mean, this is not a secret room. It's just straight up the devil deal. And we can either go with Festive Gift. 20% points for every enemy killed with this wand. So every time you kill an enemy, it shoots a projectile. The has why Festive Gifts. Oh, really, really good cooldown and fire interval. Actually, the cooldown's better than the fire interval, which is really good because we only are using one spell. This is summoning thing. We don't take summoning thing, we just take this. I don't need to think about that that much. Uh, but I'm not gonna use it either. Because I need to build this up to use it. I guess I could do one, two, three, four, and use it. Oh, this shoots very fast. Oh yeah, here we go for sure. And let's go. It's a split shot, so this becomes a lot more expensive, but it's better. And let's go with... Um, I guess, man, that, that doesn't make sense. Yeah, electricity. Might as well have this first, have that second. This always stays last. Let's see what we got in Devil Deal. Entering a shower, witch shop, always a side shop. No, 25 chance to replicate a spell. That's a definite yes. But revealing a boss guaranteed to have this room. No, let's go here. And there is no reason to guarantee this room anyway. And the other guarantee is also not really needed. Let's go. 84 life is enough. I do. Enjoy. Let's see what the spell is going to look like now. Or at least what the fight's gonna look like now. Worst money. Okay. Whoa. Okay, that does look crazy. And I love it. I'm all here for it. The shotgun armada build. Nice. You thought you were gonna survive, but nope. I got controlling boomerangs. I got controllable boomerangs, my boy. Whoop. These controllable boomerangs have gone to the other side. They are traitors. Oh, I got hit by my own boomerangs. Five got hit for 10 damage. Let's still have a chance to heal anyway, so that's irrelevant. Off we go. A relic. Should have gone with the curse, by the way. At this point, I have gotten enough to guarantee that we could have just, you know... We were forced into rooms anyway, so not being able to see is irrelevant. And we won. I do have mana issues. I do definitely have mana issues. But the shotgun is helping us out. Uh, we found the chalice, so not getting the curse is obviously the choice. We take the chalice for sure. <laughs> wow. Unbelievable. And, oh, I need to focus here. I can't really talk while doing this. Okay, it's this one. Very easy. This was a very easy roll today. And we got the relic. Spell cast simultaneously will be having electricity between them. Now that I know that I have this, I think I should rotate back to my previous weapon. Because now I can... Uh, what would this look like? I want to see the splits... 
here. I want to see this in action. Let's see this. Is electricity a thing? I'm not seeing the electricity. I mean, I guess it is a thing, but it's not visible. What does it look like in the boomerangs? No, it's not really visible. Oh! It is visible, I guess. Sometimes. Let's try this. Just to see how it's gonna go. Money for sure. So this is supposed to be doing a lot of damage. What boomerangs that? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. We're completely countered by this guy. Stop doing that. Nice, got him. Yeah, electricity is really weird. What we push the Whoa, the Exploder Boy doesn't care if you push him down or not. He's gonna still destroy you. The boomerang the reflector boys are very dangerous. What are you talking about? Super dangerous. Super dangerous opponents. Okay, got him. Very nice. And I guess we're gonna have to fight even more of these. Whoop, laser boys. These are also super dangerous, but we got him. Oh, this is a very hard fight today that we're fighting. On normal mode, by the way. On normal mode. I do enjoy electricity. What is this? Hydra blood? Heal some health. I'm gonna still keep that in case we get either a relic that says you get more potions. Or any type of deal that makes sense here. You know what? I'm gonna rotate back to what we used to have. I don't think electricity is that much worth it. Uh, let's go with super tracking shots. Actually, no. I was over here. Like that. Right? Yeah, something like this. Let's rotate like that. Yeah, that's what we're gonna go with. Let's go relics, as I said. Nope. Opponent's toast. Very nice. Boomerangs all over the place. I have to say, I really like the boomerangs, and I also really like the tracking of... The tracking shots that they're using. Whoop, 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 whoop. Zigzag everything. I avoided everything. Luck is with us. I just got a five-coiner right there. Nice, let's destroy those boys that just pop from the ground that don't even do anything, to be honest. Shotgun them to the face. It's gonna be good against bosses, if it could even work against bosses. Oh, I thought the room was over. My bad. AoE, that's good for the sword and pretty much everything. Two mana regen is godlike, as always. So I would say we go with the two mana regen. This is good for what I want to build, but this is good for everything. <laughs> let's go relics. Obviously. Here I would like to just stick to the corner and just destroy these guys through the walls with my boomerangs. Because honestly, these guys are not for us. These guys pull us in. They're like melee damage opponents. Right now they're not really pulling us in though, which is good. The boomerangs can attack through walls anyway, so there is no risk. There is no reason to even risk whatsoever. I'm seeing the sword. Seeing the blades on the ground. And we won. Nope, we didn't win. And now we're fighting ghosts. And in general, ghosts are pretty durable. Whoop. Now the good thing is that theoretically we should have some coverage on the ghosts as we can attack them with the boomerangs. And also having controllable shots is also helping with the ghosts a lot. Okay, voice and chance to heal. or money is power. Or more mana region. We're gonna obviously go with more mana region. Four mana region, that is. That's really, really good. And let's continue going on. And we even found more money and more spells. Man, at this point, the curse that said you can't see where you're going would literally do no downside. Although, in the same vein... Wow. In the same vein, it doesn't matter because I did get the relic and that gives us money anyway. So, yeah. I would like to maintain more than 180... Oh, stay away from me. That stupid thing has killed so many runs. You guys have no idea. That explode on death thing. You have no idea how many runs... I, I, I mean, you have no idea. It's about... I would say three to four runs have died from that. I won't pull it alone. Let's see what we get. Oh, we got the money is power. 34 damage right now. Has been a long time since I played a money is power build. Rainbow is also a thing I've never played before, by the way. Max mana or hover. Uh, I guess rainbow and max mana. I mean, hover is whatever. Do I have a hover? I don't have a hover. I just want to get things I already have so I can combine them before I even do anything. But I didn't. Let's go on. Uh, shopping is what I would say. We still want keys. We only have one by this and we also want spells i found a double cast which i want to take because i already have a double cast what is this bonquette book wet spells randomly died this is really re this is in general a really good a book it's not a book though you know a really good wand is what i'm trying to say although i believe that getting wands that give you passives are is better than getting ones that just give you are good <laughs> let's roll them this is a uh, no and i found my third up on my three double shots so I can combine them now. Let's also get a key. 64 coins is nice. AoE is really something I want if I can get the sword that I want. This is a decent build. Oh, this is a really good one, actually. Less mana cost. It's a five spot. It's a six spot, though. And even this one is a six spot. Um, theoretically, this is a really good wand. Let's roll them, though. 
Warlock Satchel. Yeah, let's just get some stuff. Who cares? And we found that all ones get AoE. So let's throw this one out. Or everything gets AoE now. And now we have more AoE pretty much. That's the main thing we do here. Oh man, these blades. I love it. I love the blades, how we have them going on. In general, I enjoy what you've built here. Yeah, let's actually keep things that I want to keep in and down below. This is a reroll time. No, all of these are rerollable. This is also rollable. These definitely stay. Yeah, these are the things that will stay. These are the things that are going to get rerolled. And I want money. And there is a key here, which I didn't see. Did I literally buy the whole shop? Yeah, I did buy the whole shop. Nice. Let's go. I got a coin. Uh, this here should theoretically be an issue. Um, there is no theoretical. This this should be an issue. Stop attacking for a moment. Uh-oh. Whoa, and it's boom uh, ah. Boomerangs. Let's go against the boss. And now we're going to get destroyed. I'm not going to be able to avoid these. Oh, I'm trying my best. And we got him before he destroyed us. Nice. Heal a little bit. Off into God spells. Give us something awesome. Spellbreaker. That's the build I want to build. So we're going to take Spellbreaker. The sword build. And Thunderstorm Plus to reroll it into either damage or anything else. I want to reroll that, obviously. So, uh, what I want to do is... Well, right now I can just do this. Which is going to be... Wherever this goes, it's going to slash over boomerangs. Uh, or otherwise, I can also still stick to boomerangs. And then when they come to us, I will start slashing. Well, for now, we're going to go with the bullets slash. By the way, I could also do something like this. Oh, this, this looks so cool, but it's so expensive. Go with Spellbreaker for now. So in case you don't know, the sword says that it does more damage based on... Uh, it has more AoE based on how much damage it does. Wait a minute. 27 mana region. Wait, wait. I could do something like this. What would that look like? Double, tripled? Ah, it's just in one, one more. AoE, mana region, mana region, AoE. Yeah, I could try this. How much damage does this do? 42. 42 damage is a sizable amount. Does this work, by the way? No, it doesn't. Yeah, I do enjoy this. The Sword Slash YOLO play. And the other build can stay as is. So we have both of these in case I need to transition over to another build. How does electricity look on this? It doesn't look on this. <laughs> yeah, I think we're good on with this, what I'm doing. I can get some Thunder Strikes, but I don't really need them. Yeah, let's let's go. Let's go. I want to do this. Big Swords build. Yep. I do get the slashes fast. What is this? Boom, boom. Nope. Whoa, we're super powerful. And these guys don't even spawn anything. Yeah, these opponents literally are unable to spawn anything. Because I eat the bullets. Because my sword eats bullets. The swords destroy the bullets in the air. So literally having a double slash it just burns everything. Perfect, perfect. This is this is happening. This is happening. Uh, I would say we go with rerolls because that's literally what I'm trying to create here. So let's go rerolls whenever I have the choice to do so. Uh, yeah, we have so many things that need to get away. Although I just spend money by doing this. I, I should try to keep as much money as I can. I'm making a couple of mistakes here and there with what I'm choosing to do. Let's combine those. So that's now five. Three shots. Yep, that's now three swords. Not that that's helping that much, but whatever. Uh, let's reroll whatever into any of the things we already have. We're gonna keep that so we can reroll it into another thing. Reroll this. Damage is always a yes. Reroll mana. Uh, what is this? No loop the shots. I don't care about that. Oh, we got our boomerang. Let's roll this into a higher version of something I want. Yes, AoE. Um, arcane explosions. I have two of them. I also have two duets. Also have two boomerangs. Two thunder cores. A lot of twos. Ooh, this is a lot better. Yeah, I'm thinking about the fact that I want to... I don't think duet matters. I'm not going to use duet anymore. The fact fact of the matter is... We're not going to use duet anymore. So... And neither boomerang. I'm going full on sword build. I, the sword build is coming together. Let's start rerolling rares that I don't care about away. Like this thing. It, this might become the spell breaker that I actually want. Left, release, right? No. Uh, not really. No... Four more slots. I want to see what this looks like. Okay. I mean, the less damage is pretty bad. But, I mean, look at this. How I'm thinking about this. This right now is 41 damage. If I do this, it's 33. But if I do this, it's 40. 
So this is good because this allows us to put these things in the build. The spell damage. And I can have two spell damage ups, which right now I don't have. You know what? I can actually test this. I, I, it used to be 43, right? 41. 41. So with this, with this, it's 40. And this, 48. So this is actually good. This expansion zone is good. Final damage, 8%. Yeah, it makes it a lot worse. But it gives us room to actually put damage inside anyway. And AoE, for that matter. That's good. That's really good. Now the question is, you know what? I'm going to keep everything I have. We're in no rush in spending our money, although we're already spent a bunch of money. This is super cool, man. I love it. I guess Echo should be rerolled. Ooh, look at this, man. Huge sword. It also does a bunch of damage. I love it. 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 We're, we're slowly getting there. I mean, might as well put the Thunder Core on this at this point. Yeah, might as well. Let's go. Bye-bye, you guys. Whoa, look at this. I'm going to room and everything dies. Boom, 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 bye, bye, bye. Look at all these spiders going away. They're going extinct, man. They're going extinct. And we're still not there yet. We're still not there yet. I have mana issues, by the way. <laughs> he tries to shoot at us? What do you think you're doing? You cast from afar? Definitely no. Missing health gives you damage, maybe. Body size, less recoil, more max HP. Does body size help us in any way, shape, or form? I would say missing life gives you damage. I don't know. And let's lose life here to get a chest. The chest gave us a chance to decrease or increase. I'm gonna still keep these in case I get the relic. Uh, specifically the relic that says that, you know, ooh, the AoE explosion with the lightning is insanely huge. I love that. Okay. Uh, the relic that says that you get max health and max mana every time you drink a potion. These guys are spawning stuff, but as you can see, we easily just delete them. A rare that I would like to reroll and another I would like to reroll. Let's get rares. And we want to reroll rare so I can get the spell break upgraded. Can I test this thing here? Ooh, slash. Cool design. Completely irrelevant to what I'm trying to do, though. I want to be like, boom, and everything dies. Yeah, shop is useless without money, so let's go money. Whoa, almost died there. Man, these Exploder Boys, as I said, super dangerous. Super dangerous, and you can literally not do anything up against them. Wanna make my sword bigger. Da -da -dun, da -da 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 -dun, dun. Uh, fun spells, I'm gonna go spells. As I said, we are gonna do. We don't need to always follow the exact same thing. I still believe that getting relics is the best, but based on what build you want to do, which in this specific instance my build is, I want to get a bunch of random stuff. Uh, actually, I want to get a bunch of these um, enhanced damages and enhanced ranges. That's what I want to do with this one. Another expansion stone. Nice, I'm going to take that for sure. And uh, I guess I'm going to go energy saver. It's, it's irrelevant what that one's going to be, as I don't even have anything for it. So, can I actually have another expansion stone on this? Is that a thing? Ooh. Now my damage is 40. Otherwise, my damage is 53. Yeah, this is super cool, man. The stones are very, very, very good. I will de continue decreasing my strength, but I will still also continue increasing my strength. So, so it's a potato-potato game. Let's go here. Money, obviously. Strength is very important because that's the size of the swords. I didn't even read that, by the way. Here, you can read it at the very... I mean, it's kind of... The editor's gonna line it up. Eliminate most... No, no, not that one. Uh, size is related to damage. The final line there. Let's get those. Maybe I shouldn't even pick these up. Maybe I should first open this thing up. We have enough keys, though. Let's see what we're gonna get. And I got... Curses give you damage. Unable to see the... Unable to see your own stats. No, I do enjoy that. And resources. No. Terms and chance. The dead enemy will return into souls and player for six seconds. No, no. I don't care about any of those two. So we wasted the key for nothing. Let's go even more money. Especially with the relic that gives money if you have money. What about you? Hey, look, it's opponents. And they're gone. And look, it's opponents. And they're gone. Nice. It's like we just go in and slash everything to death. My name is Cloud. Or Berserk. I don't know. I haven't seen Berserk yet. Uh, this is the... Wong, Wong, Wong. <laughs> this is the teleporter room from Pokemon. Okay, bottom right, bottom right, bottom right, bottom right, bottom left. No, boom, 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 boom. Whoa. Ah. Boom, 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 and bottom right. No, boom, 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 bottom right. No, I'm saying bottom right, but I'm just choosing something. And we got Lightning Dash. Ooh. Lightning Dash leveled up, actually. Wait a minute. Upon completion, trigger an explosion that dispels most spells in 2.5 effect radius. You know what I want to do with this? You go here. 
Nice. And you go here. Let's see this. Oh, boom. Go. Boom. <laughs> I love it. Uh, let's say we is needed. More. Oh, this is needed. Boom. Oh, this lasts a while. Okay. Very cool. Completely useless. Very cool, though. Uh, let's throw this out. I mean, it's it's not completely useless. Because it's a rare one that's going to get rerolled into my Spellbreaker leveled up. Uh, what was I copying previously? You know what? I, I think it was damage. If it wasn't damage, it's damage now. And, uh... Mana regen is back. This is not something I'm using. Yeah, I don't care about it. We're playing with a sword. Let's fight the boss, which should be the cloud and the laser beam thing. As far as I know... As far as I remember, that should be it. Yeah, it's a cage. Let's actually see how much this does. This is a sizable damage here that we're getting. And then this. Oh, this is so much more sexy. Whoa. Boom, boom, boom. Got him. Boom, got him. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. MP region, health, whatnot. No, I'm still sticking to... We're gonna drink them when needed. Slash, slash, slash. Oh, he's gonna do the balls. Yes, we go back to bullets. And then we go back to slashing. And we're gonna wait. Bullet him down. Let's go back to slashing. And I think I perfected the boss, unless I'm gonna get it exactly this moment. And I almost got, but I didn't. Easy enough. And I also had a block of 10, which as far as I know, it actually helps you with not losing the perfect. I sure before I open this up, the first thing I'm gonna do is we're gonna switch to this one, which is never gonna change. We're gonna switch to this one. See what we get. We can either get crazy crit rate, which is really good for us. A huge thing. Or a mimic cube. Shape shifter. This is a huge cooldown, which is really bad for us. Full solver is completely useless for us. We're gonna go here. Scatter is good for us, actually. Alchemage's folded sword is good. Scatter for the swords means more range. It, it does a bigger cycle. So this is super, super good for us. Whips and crit chance is also good. The thing is huge. It's also good. We're taking this. Uh, and now we're gonna just straight up transfer everything over to that. So we're gonna go boom, boom. Wait a minute. I wanna see this. So this thing has a scatter of 150. And as you see, it ends. It's been a corner, so let's be like in a corner here so it's very visible. No, it's not visible. It ends almost exactly where I am, right? So let's transition these over. Which, by the way, I don't even need to transition the. Um, the stone over, but I will transition it right now so I can see the different the same size. Click. Yeah, now it goes and uh, maybe a smidge behind us. So this has 57 damage. If I remove the stone right now, as I'm not using it, 71, which makes it a smidge bigger. Once again, we don't really have anything to put in here to make it more valuable. So let's just go. You guys can go down here. And these are all useless, as we said. So this is the main build as of this moment. Uh the sword's a bit slower, but it's okay. There isn't anything to put in there. Which is also okay. Uh, let's go. Once again, I could do duet with this, just to be clear. I want to showcase this. I could do, you know, sword throws. But I don't want to do that. I want to be a clean sword build. Clean as, as it goes. Nice. Mana region. Mana region might be the one useless thing. Yeah. I think we're good here. Let's have it like that. These stones are going to go there at some point. These are also going to all leave. Uh, yeah, let's go. And the curses are your airborne forever. You can unlock everything, but you, I already have four keys. Or uh, you always find these. I mean, theoretically, airborne forever is cool, but nah, whatever. Let's go. The next area doesn't even have that many traps. I got five coins. This is going to be a very fast one. Are we recording? Yes, we are. Nice, 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 nice. And let's go relics forced on us. Boom. Oh, these guys survived? Okay. Nice. This The slow sword slash is, is pretty bad, but it's okay. We might find a better... I mean, I don't even need to find a better uh, wand. I just want to find... I don't know. Uh, first of all, one of the solutions could be the thing that says your cooldown's better. There is a thing that does that. Heal, what is this? Immune to spikes on the ground and venom. Eh. Ah, chance to generate the shield. Ah, gain a point temporary when you kill enemies. Maybe. Maybe a bit of healing. All of these are whatever. Let's go here. There are four chests. It's unbelievable that I just found three chests in this room and I'm instantly about to throw away all my money. What is this? Deal damage when you get damaged. Chance to generate shield. I'm about to throw away my keys, not my money. 
and uh, vicious crystal plus a unlock every unbelievable that that just happened uh, let's drink the permanent stat gain I always get the stat gain and now we have unlock everything let's go into shop I would say uh, I'm gonna buy one key and we're gonna try to find I think with two keys and the potion we're okay like, that's pretty much three keys until the end of the game I would like to find more slashes there are there is a double rare shop here so that's nice and I can also check the storage wand over here which is useless it has four rares though for re-rolling but 70 coins for four rares is just a no Arcane Explosion is a yes though because I can instantly combine them. So that's done. I just combine Arcane Explosion easy enough. Might as well hide these down here so we don't reroll them by mistake. Let's see what we find. Dormant Whispers. Uh, when you kill something it does damage. Yeah, we know that. Uh, I mean, I definitely prefer the 40% crit chance. That's nice. Crit chance and if you hit an opponent it splits. But no, I want to find my sword. Good mana region and things I don't care about. On the mimic cube. What is this? Source of all plagues. Um, this just has a bunch of mana region. What's the point here? I guess the idea is that it has so much mana that you can summon a godlike summon and it also gives you two summon buffs. This is what? No. Uh, I'll definitely go with being able to mimic buffs we already are using. On the same dormant whisper twice. Ooh, double key for cheap is nice. I don't care about echo. And I also don't care about this. And we didn't really find anything of value. Rainbow electric net, not really. I could take this for the charging node level up. I don't think it's worth it though. Let's keep the money for reroll strength. And these are both useless. Uh, let's definitely copy another damage up with the mimic, which is where? Here it is. Actually, what's the AOE difference here? It's, uh, let's have some kind of, I'm between these two. Yeah, I'm stuck here and it goes up to up to the end of the screen, right about here, up to the end of the screen, let's say. So if instead of copying damage, instead of a range, I copy damage, it's almost the same thing, but I also get the damage, so we're going to go with this. Oh, we found a locked key. I have four keys, so we're done with keys. I really hope we're going to have enough money for the rest of the game to be able to use everything. I, I don't think we're doing a lot, enough damage, by the way. I want to get more of those plus damage arrows. Whoa! Oh, this is not blockable. Okay, we found something new. Good thing I killed enough opponents to get the shielding there. Nice, I got the rerolls of spells. That's where we're going to definitely go to. When HP is below 25, start healing. Useless. Uh, all damage up, but all damage received up. Unable to see your own stats and resources. Oh, come on, man. I'm going to go here. Humpson damage up and damage received up. I right, take this and we are literally blind. It is what it is. It is what it is. Can I see what my weapons do though? Yeah, I can. That's what I care about. So this should make my sword huge, right? Because I just got humps and damage up. It did. Money is incoming. Uh, let's combo things that we can combo. Which specifically is the arcane explosion. Nice. Let's reroll the arcane explosion specifically because that's going to be something I care about. Nope, 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 nope. Well, no. Ah, that's okay actually. Nope. Nope. Mana region. Yeah, might as well. Do a switch on that one. What happened? Did they just reroll both of my bullets? Where's my second bullet? It became penetration. What? I guess I rerolled both. I don't know. Uh, duets are here. I would like to reroll this into a sword, actually. The sword slash I'm already using. Nope. Nope. Electricity was good, but... Uh, are you serious? Nope. Okay, I guess. Do I have the sword slash twice? No, I have it only one time. Which makes it pretty bad. Let's roll this into any of the 50,000 things. We found the cooldown thing I might have wanted. Let's roll other stuff. Nope, nope. Uh, chance to cast spells. I don't care about that that much. In general, it's good, but... And I'm out of money. Okay, so cooldown could go in here. Penetration is useless. If I got cooldown in here, it just attacks faster. Which isn't really that useful because we have mana issues anyway. I can see the mana on the sword, by the way. Is it? I don't think we do have mana issues. So right now I'm at the 1000 damage. If I do this... Talking about DPS specifically. Yeah, electricity seems to be guaranteed. Um, I don't think it's more damage, though. Yeah, this doesn't feel more, it feels less. So we're gonna go back to consistency. And we still have a bunch of buffs over here. I think we're good to go. 
we still have so many things that we need to reroll away. Uh, also, I need to find more of these damage ups. Yeah, we need so much money. Let's go. I don't even know. I mean, we're out of money, by the way. So that's already an issue. And we want spells ups or damage ups. Unlock everything in the room. Okay, I mean, we have enough keys for the rest of the game. So that's a useless potion. And our potions, we have heal a smidge. Mana region forever. Wait, what is this? Double the amount of keys. Okay, we're gonna go mana region forever. And we're gonna also go double the keys right now. I just got three keys, so we have six. And we got spells, that's nice. What are these? <laughs> for how often do we will we have these around us? And we got the anti-curse, which I'm gonna instantly drink. Boom. Nice. And just like that, we have my stats back. Look how many things we have around us, by the way. We found a volley, which is useless. A venom, which is useless. I don't have a pillar to copy. Right, let's get whatever to... Whatever to... Let's go here. We have enough. What is this? Oh, a dodge for 25 seconds or something. Yeah, that's going to be a very easy room. <laughs> not not sure if you can see why it's going to be an easy room, but... Room, but... Room, but... Okay, let's hope we're going to find the sword times two. I like what we're doing. Uh, maybe getting the thing that says that when the spell ends, it casts the spell again around you. That might be really fitting. Okay, tracking enhanced. A lot of tracking today. A lot of tracking. Off we go to the next one. 112 damage is a sizable amount. Good thing is that these guys that are supposed to split, anything that has to do with split or explode on death on anything that has to do with on death just gets completely countered because of us slashing with five swords. Rich ends up, that's very good. I don't care about the rest. Not a good chance up. Combined spells. 37 coins isn't that much, but still, let's continue trying this, forcing this. So, we don't really have anything to combine, but I can now reroll the tracking, as that's useless for us. And we might find the sword I'm already using. Nope. Nope. Well, uh, we had that previously. Nope. Nope. Ah, uh, crits are better. Let's go with crits are better. Oh, yeah. That's a sizable increase in damage. Yeah, but that's only an increase in damage because of the split crit thing that the w the way it works is why it makes it better, not that it's actually better. On oh, the Spellbreaker Plus, very nice. So this is base damage 39, this is base damage 78. And this has a scatter 180. Yeah. Reverse recoil size is related to damage. Yeah, this is going to be a lot better. 220. Whoa. This is huge. Nice. Next thing to get, I would say we want more of the enhanced damage and the enhanced range. So let's start rolling random trash stuff into that. This is a comma that could instantly roll into one of those, so let's do that. I'm running out of money, by the way. Nope, nope, nope. 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 And we're out of money. Off we go. Is there anything we want? I don't think we, there is anything we want. I think we should just go on. And we can't really combine anything either. Unless I'm wrong about that, but I don't think I am. Yeah, nope, let's go on. Goes this. Hey, boss. Now that's going well. Are you gonna do anything? Yeah, I don't see you doing anything. Boss is gone. Easy enough. <laughs> We're pretty busted, man. Let's see what we get. Nice. This is a rare plus, so it's gonna roll into what I want. And this is a common plus, so might as well take that too. Although the crits could be good, but I don't think so. So, this is useless, specifically for us right now, but... You know what? I would like to see the boomerangs with that. I don't have enough money to go there again. Let's go spells. Uh, and just because I mentioned it, might as well try this for a moment. Oh, this looks super cool. Okay, I would like to not control this, actually. Uh, do the boomerangs? I don't think they do it. I lost a lot of play for no reason. Are they forced? No, no, they still come back to us. Yeah, if, if the boomerangs come back to us, there is no reason for us to have these tracking shots on the boomerangs. Nice, bye. Let's see if I can get even more slashes. Nope. Ghost snake, no. I'm gonna get the rare, obviously, and uh, whatever on the rest. And we're out of room. Uh, let's just put things wherever. Doesn't really matter. We have so much room here because of those gemstones. And I still haven't really found damage, just to be clear. I, I am aware that I can use the stones on my thing, but I don't think there is a reason to do that, because, once again, this does more AoE with more damage, and if I put the stone there, it's gonna make it smaller. Uh, yeah, here, fact of the matter is... I'll showcase this. Uh, what does the speed do? 
I mean, I could just throw more things in now, though. Electricity is useless, right? Yeah, this electricity is useless. I can make opponents get slowed. Yeah, this is not worse. I'm still doing insane damage. What would this look like? Sing, 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 sing. Yeah, this is better, but we're out of mana, but I'm, so I'm gonna stick to one big one. Or I could do volley, which makes things cheaper, and do a dual cast on this thing. Boom. This is a lot more, by the way. This is like double attack. Yeah, this is a lot more damage, so we're gonna stick to this. Not right now, I'm shooting both of these at the same time. Let's go money. Boom. Boom. Yeah, that's actually a lot better. Yeah, let's actually invest. Let's actually go into using those stones, man. Those stones are very powerful. Because you can just get more slots, and more slots means more passives. And some passives don't even cost you mana or anything. Some passives are just like more AoE, more attack speed, more... Uh, crafting, we're gonna definitely go in there too. Uh, you know what? There are two things, so might as well unlock them both. I cannot heal for a while, but I will get max mana. Okay, this is... I need to focus. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. And over there, and then this. Okay. Boom. 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 And over there. And then I think like this. No, it was here. Ah, let me actually not talk and just do this. I guess editor's gonna splice this in. Got it. Okay, we got black holes. Which we can see. Black hole. Lol, this is insanely huge. I love it. We're sticking to the... Obviously with the sword slashes. Because that's the build. Uh, I do have money for this. But I think we're gonna go money. So we build up a little bit more economy. And then we can go back to that. There is no reason to avoid money. Like money is the most important thing. I don't even have enough money right now. To even be able to do that. Yeah, that's not gonna survive. Right, like... I think it's better to go for money when I have the chance. Enemies cannot detect you until you launch an attack. Relic time. We're gonna definitely find more combos. And also, let's not forget that we still have the relic that says the more money we have, the more money we gain when we enter a new room. By you guys? What was that green thing? Seed of Greed. Wait, what is Seed of Greed blocking? From what am I healing? What's happening here? What are these plus ones I'm getting? Oh, the lifesteal, the lifesteal. Seed of Greed is building up from the lifesteal we have, I remember. Petrify yourself and become immune to everything. Yeah, pretty useless. Uh, 5 HP when entering floor. 20 max health. 11 chance to... 20 max mana. 11 chance to... Let's go 11 chance to... Ah, let's go max mana. I don't know. They're both irrelevant. Shop. I don't care about it that much. Let's go spells. Get the money first. Spells is what I want anyway. And the shop is still gonna sell spells, but I need my money to buy... Whoa, whoa, whoa. I got damaged very heavily there. I need my money to buy... Rerolls to use it on rerolls. Nice. That's a rare again. And the rest are useless. But I have two of these, so I might be able to combine them. Continue with spells. Continue with spells. I'm not sure if you can get a leveled up spell. Seed of Greed is super duper farming itself up. Where is this thing? 42 out of 50. Whoa! I really hate those spawning below you. Tracking. Do I have enough of these to combo them? It's closing in. Uh, might as well do a Guardian. You know what? Let's go here. Might as well have the shooting. Why not? And uh, is there a reason to change anything here? I don't think so. It's going to be tracking shooting on its own. It's going to do whatever it wants. Let's go money for sure. And we have boomerangs now flying out. Let's lose some... Ah, there was no reason for me to lose that life either. Grant immunity to do Venom. Let's drink this right away. Immunity to Venom and poison everything. I can't control my character. Isn't this something awesome? We roll all spells in your backpack. Godlike. The most godlike. <laughs> I, I was correct about this. Isn't this awesome? It is actually awesome. I really believe this is one of the best things that is out there. Let's get this and use it. Honestly. Although I'm gonna get even more spells in the moment. We're gonna use in the moment. Let's heal a random amount. And let's not by mistake drink this. So let's have the Petrify Potion. So. The idea is... Well, for now, we're going to get more spells, and we're going to roll a lot of them at the same time. That's what the idea is. Instant death there. Instant death here, too. Is this the final boss? No. No, that's the final boss. No! Super disappointed. Do, 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 do. Increase movement speed forever. Might as well. Super disappointed. Super disappointed that I'm not going to have another chance to use anything. Another rare and a passive. Yeah, what is this? Oh, we don't have room. That's what that is. 
Okay, so I will do the rerolls. First of all, I got the chance to shoot, so that goes down here, and we literally got another build that I can create. Uh, which is gonna be... This is useless. I guess... Duet. Yeah, duet that shoots out bullets that I can use, and then it becomes... <laughs> this is so stupid. No, I guess just build up turrets. Is there anything up here I care? I, I really care about? This is what I care about. Okay. So this is not. I guess this could combine. Mm, nope, I don't care about anything else. Let's also reroll this then. And these stay as they are. Yeah, let's reroll everything in the backpack. Just to see what we would have could have gotten. So look at this. I got my two multi shots lined up and ready. I got poison, so that's nice. I got an, uh, I got a bunch of guardian spirits ready, so this is useless. Guardian spirit. And another guardian spirit. Nice. So... What would I like these to do? I guess this can multi-shot. I can... Yeah, I think we're good with this line up here. Man, I didn't really get anything that would fit in this build, which is very unlucky. I didn't roll a single uh, AoE. I didn't roll a single uh, image or anything of that matter. Uh, yeah, let's go max mana on this, I guess. Poison boomerang is what I would like here to have. Yeah, let's go with this one being the good one. Uh, tracking poison boomerangs with mana regen and uh, slows down the opponents. That is even not a thing that I have. Uh, when they're fast, I don't know. Then we can have duet here with butterflies. Also, I don't know. And then we also have walls that uh, when they set up the electrify opponents. Once again, I don't know. And even we can have more of them. And the same goes with this one. We can have more of these. So all of these are going to be shooting all over the place while I'm going to be doing my slash attacks. Let's go fight the boss. Let's go destroy them with my pet armada here. Get them cloud strife. Let's go. Oh, the boss is getting yeeted and deleted very fast. And we are already at phase two. Yep. I look at all the butterflies running towards the boss. Oh, I should have had the movement speed on the butterflies. Oh, it is on the butterflies. No, it's not. Eh, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, this guy has a million butterflies on its feet. Let's go again. My slashes are very slow. And methodical, I would say. Whoa! Trying to get my first stacks leveled up. Let's go over here on the left side. Almost got cursed. But I didn't, and we won. Easy enough. Rotate away from the curses. Continue rotating away from the curses. Just because of principle. And the curses become normal shots, and when they become normal shots, they just despawn. Nice! Uh, enemies cannot detect you. Yeah, whatever. Let's also take this, another 3 blood. And now I have 22 blood. The reason I played normal mode is because I wanted to get more meta progression. Specifically more red stuff, because the purple stuff you get on hard mode easier. But the purple, the purple, this one, the red one, which unlocks new classes, and more specifically the summoner class, which I would like to play. Um, you need those. And uh, yeah, I think that's going to be it. Tomorrow I will try to do summoning class without having the summoning class unlocked. If we're lucky enough. And then after that I know what we're going to do. Let's definitely go max mana. We're done with most of these. We're only missing max starting max health, which uh, I, if I have shown anything, it's irrelevant. And then backpack size is pretty relevant for that one potion we use, but otherwise it's also relevant. You have enough room to just have everything all over the place. Um, I could unlock these, but once again, we really have them anyway, so that's irrelevant too. Man, I want this game to launch. Look how many more things there are. I can only... This game is literally the amount of its spells. Like, literally, like, if, if the spell list wasn't this and was doubled or tripled, it would have made a huge difference. It has a long time since I got the Pyrocore, by the way. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. I think Pyrocore doesn't even exist here. Does it? Wow. Wait, what? No, it, it doesn't hear this. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. As always, thanks for watching, and see you guys around.